is going on boys and girls Richie here and welcome back to the YouTube channel um, before we dive into today's topics be sure to hit that like button also subscribe if you're someone new and hit that notification bell so you get my videos first and with that being said let's dive right into things so the game awards last night were a little lackluster um, uh, but congratulations to uh, It Takes Two for winning game of the year. I would say that game deserved it. Even though I wanted Metroid Dread to win, um, and Metroid Dread won best action game, so it's I guess it's really not that big a deal. Uh, Nintendo put out a quality game this year, so yeah, congratulations to Metroid Dread for winning best action game. But yeah, I don't understand why the Game Awards get so much hate. I mean, I, I would say that the show is a little too long, and... They do focus a little bit more on endorsements and sponsors and and stuff like that. I feel like they should they should stop with that so much and maybe focus a little more on the games that won. That's that's at the end of the day, you know, you're talking about games, you know, celebrities and endorsements are cool, but you know, like come on, man. Like a little bit more on the games. I appreciate what Jeff Keeley does. Uh, I don't think he gets enough credit. Uh, for what he does, but but yeah, so um, the Game Awards, a little lackluster, but there it is. And as of this morning, um, the adaptation, the live adaptation to Cowboy Bebop is uh, officially getting cancelled. Uh, critics basically destroyed it. I mean, in what in what dimension, in what world did the fans even ask for a live adaptation of Cowboy Bebop? There are some things that just need to be left alone and Hollywood and big producers and they just, they don't really seem to understand that there's some, there's some things in this world that you just need to leave alone. Nobody ever asked for a prequel to The Wizard of Oz, but for some reason they gave us one. It's just, it's, it's just, I don't know. There's, leave things that are sacred alone. Let them be let them let them be as they are that's that's all there is to it you just leave those things alone i was never for a live adaptation of cowboy bebop the anime was perfect as it was and uh juice world's posthumous uh album fighting demons is also out now i'm still like still still not feeling too good after uh, juice world died we lost we lost a good one um but yeah, if you're if you like Juice World, maybe go check that out. I'm definitely going to. Uh, rest in peace, Juice World. Love you, brother. And with that, this video is a wrap, officially wrapped, like a Christmas present. Thank you guys so much for listening and watching, and I will catch you guys on the next episode later.